body. If your body wasn't an active energy storage, how is the chip gonna be activated in your body, man? Right. All right? We're gonna finish this off and then we're gonna. The beginning, ending, and midst of times, yep. the alteration of the turning of sun and the change of seasons, yep. the circuits of years and the position of stars, yep. the nature, the natures of living creatures. Yo, yep, cause you, you he us the nature of living creatures. Oh, you got some called the dog whisperer, man. King Solomon knew the nature of all animals, man. All right. In the fury, in the furies of wild beasts. Yep. The violence of winds and the reasoning of men. Yep. The diversity of plants yep. and the virtues of roots. King Solomon knew the diversities of plants, man. Mm. The uses of plants. Going back to Sirach, all things that are uses. But then it goes to the virtues of roots, man. So a lot of roots, the roots have healing power. They still have a remnant of that knowledge over there in India, man. China, India, they have their gurus. Cause they've been studying the earth for thousands of years, man. All right, you got a yakin none. That's all I wanted. All right. Uh, <clears throat> this is a uh, Sirach 39 and 26. It says the principal things for the for the whole use of man's life are water, fire. Himalayan sea salt, they got videos where they tell you to put the Himalayan sea salt in your body. It's so nutrient dense that you don't really have hunger pains like that. See, real food, real food sustains hunger. <laughs> food that has no nutri no uh, nutritional content, nutritional content, you get hungry within an hour or two. Because right. it's, it's empty calories. Yeah. Like you eat a, a real salad with everything in it, it's like I only ate a salad, but I ain't even that hungry anymore. Hey, that, that's actually what diabetes is. It's uh, your body thinking that it's uh, basically full of nutrients and it overproduces a chemical to break all those nutrients down and when it tries to do that it creates uh, insulin in, yeah and then uh, but because your body doesn't use that insulin or I forget the correct chemical breakdown but basically you know, that's where diabetes comes from. Then it gets, oh, you get, you get it released into your bloodstream. Because mm -hmm. it, it can't retain the insulin, and it gets released into your bloodstream. Now you got the tingly hands and shit. All right? But going back to, uh, you, you're tricking your brain, man. Because um, I saw a visual of it, the documentary Forks Over Knives. It's like when you eat, when you eat, like, you know, basically healthy, like, you know, from the earth, I'm not, I'm not talking about not eating meat, but it's from the earth. Your body, um, it releases that chemical that you can, that you eat enough, and it does it pretty fast. Yeah. But it takes a lot of empty calories to tell your brain that you eat enough. You know? Some, some sort of effect, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I gotta put, all right, go ahead. It's Matthew 5. Uh, just back you up, I'll be you going back to what you got. Right. This is Matthew 5, and, uh, Oh yeah, 5 and 13. Ye are the salt of the earth. But if the salt has lost its savor, where would shall it be salty? Now the other word goes into this all the time, man, the power of salt. Now it tells you in Genesis that let the earth bring let the waters bring forth the moving creature. Who was that moving creature? It was us. We came from out of those waters. That's why I would think your, 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 your semen is the it's, it's water. It's water carrying your semen when you ejaculate. So you're being carried through water. You came out of those waters. Yeah. But what's one of those uh, abundant substances in water? Salt. Yeah. Salt, because salt has all those nutrients and minerals in, in the waters, man. That's why when, and that's why you are salty. Right. <laughs> when you sweat, sweat. sweat. Yeah. 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 sweat. You sweat, it's salty. Your pee smells like salt. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hey, another example. Like if you cry, like if you sleep, yeah. you got that crust. That crust is like salt. Yeah, so salt looks water. in the waters. Yeah. We, you know? Yeah. Like dry salt, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Your sweat dry. Your sweat dry salt, man. All right. I heard somebody say this. That was like you would know a girl, a woman ain't take a bath if you kissing on her, she she uh, taste salty. <laughs> yeah. You know, somebody said that a long time ago. Yeah. But like that, as you think about it, you know. Hey, what did uh, Lot's wife turn into? Pillar uh -oh. of salt. So they kill her. Cause when you go into the, the hey, <laughs> well, it's not bad. When you go into the the, uh, the beginning, man, you go into the description you just brought out. Uh -huh. One of those uh, vital things that we need is salt, man. Right. Yep. You know, and not not that that uh, that cheap salt. Yeah. The earth yeah, needs right. us. And the earth needs us. <laughs> the earth needs us, man. All right, go ahead, y'all can learn this and what's that? All right. Yeah, it's a little more. Let's start over. This is a rock. 13 and 26. The principal things for the whole use of man's life are water, fire, iron, and salt. One, uh, flour of wheat, honey, milk, and the blood of the grape, and oil and clothing. Yep. Hey, it just broke everything down right there. You know? And that's, hey, hey, the blood of the grape, man. Egg going in the wine, right? Wine. Yep. Yeah. And the most I created those. Y'all yeah, know where to keep the uh, Texas Texas Rock right through there. Through that hole in the wall and then go right. Thank you. Yeah. That's why I want to be that guy. But that's what processed food does. Yeah. Yeah. You, you look at Jake in the 70s. Yeah. 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 Jake is in shape. Yeah. But, but yeah. you know what, though? But Jake was lean with it, though. Yeah. Like, Jake would walk around like uh, bodybuilders. Jake was lean. Like bulky. Yeah, that, that was chisel. Even on those plantations on the Alice, Benjamin. Benjamin was on those plantations on the Alice. Benjamin was on the plant. Jake, Jake was, uh, they had their calisthenics look. Yeah. Their processed food, it just stores fat. Because your body, when you eat, from, when you eat grass fed, you know, and you eat from the earth, your body digests that stuff. But processed food, it doesn't digest. So it just stores. But a great, Pandemic happened around the 70s, man. Processed food. Well, I say the post World War II, but the generation that grew up after that, you look at the picture of your, your grandma in the 70s, yo, everybody was lean man. with that big afro. Yeah. But you watch that on uh, that documentary, The Magic Pill, they was looking at the aboriginals of Australia, man. And in the 70s, them dudes was chiseled, them was cut. But the generation after that, when they started taking Coca-Cola and McDonald's and they start feeding their kids that, they look horrible. And that's what happened to us, man. Yep. That's a long wood captivity. Huh? Right? What that, bro? Uh, that was, that was, man, that was my thing. Well, I'll read the next verse. I'll get that. Verse 27. Sirach. <laughs> 39 and 27 it says all these things are for good to the godly so to the sinners they are turned into evil mm. <laughs> hey he ain't got to break that down yeah. hey, it's for good for us for the godly but to the sinners they are turned into evil man because he saw you what he do he use all those things for wickedness yeah. like you say he take it and 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 uh, add ingredients into all of them and, and right, come up with a contraption to, you know, to, you know, take away, take away benefits that real health benefits for it, <laughs> you know, yeah, have it, have it destroy your body. So like, no, 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 but, but the same thing he did with, with plants. Right. He saw turned a plant into a fucking drug. Right. But he did that like, I, I, how the students went into uh, one of the necessities of life is wheat. Yeah. The flower of wheat. Yeah. Esau took that bread and processed it. What do you think a donut is? Process. It's processed wheat. It's processed bread. And then it kill you. Esau took a coca leaf uh -huh. and made yeah, crack. Yeah, right. <laughs> a leaf. Esau took a coca leaf that uh, the northern kingdom took to open up their nostrils and their breathing ability when they came with those mouths and they had to deal with that high elevation. So they, they ate the coca leaf. Well, they might have made it into a tea. But it opened up their nostrils so they could breathe on a high elevation. Each all took a leaf and made crack cocaine. <laughs> Wicked. <laughs> but Esau, Esau also Wicked. took the flour of wheat and made processed bread. Mm -hmm. I stopped eating bread for a month. My head, or, uh, for the piece of unleavened bread. Uh -huh. Within a week, my head was clear. Stomach went right. down. Right. Like, what the hell? 
Hey, then, hey, and you, you, you go without because what happens is that processed bread for a lot of people it stops. Yep. It gets stuck in your digestive tract. Right. Right. It yeah. clouds you up. So everything you eat after that gets stuck. Yeah, it's uh -huh. just sitting there. And that's how you get in the beer. That's how you get the beer. The, 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 the stomach coming from the uh, bread. Now what about what about this? What, what they call it? Yeast. A beer belly. Yeah, right, what is right. fucking beer? Yeast. It's liquid yeast. Yeah. Yeah. But it's but it's that unnatural yeast. Because the Bible, the word is said that the flour is good, yeah. but it's just yeast out there. He processes it. So that stuff. It gets, it gets, because of the liquids in your body, it gets back into that doughy substance in your digestive tract. All the food get backed up, and then it rots. Yeah. And guess what happens? You get musty. Yep. That's why when you go to the grocery store, you go to the bread section, all the whole grain wheat bread is stacked up, stocked up, yeah. and all the white high toast corn syrup yeah. bread, is, you can't hardly buy it. You're supposed to be eating whole grain wheat bread, man. You know? White out bleaches the shit. Yep. Yeah, you know? white rice, same yeah. thing. Yep. And white, white rice is bleached rice. Yeah. Bleached rice. Because Esau got this thing called white supremacy. <laughs> but everything before that had melanin. Right. Rice had melanin. Right. Real rice is dirty rice. Yeah, not dirty, not right. brown they rice. They call it dirty. Yeah, yeah. 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 they call it dirty rice. Yeah. Uh, real rice is brown rice. Yeah. Real flour is not white. It's brown. It's brown. Yeah, I didn't know that. It's brown. Yeah. Yeah. All that shit that's white in the grocery store is bleached. Yeah, right. yeah. Like, like how they do Jake. Jake got that low self esteem. They bleach their skin. Yeah. Their rice is bleached. All that shit on them shelves is bleached. Before that, everything had melanin. Everything had pigment, bro. And we, when you bleach it, you take the nutrients out. And when you take the nutrients out, you know what you eat? A fucking drug. It's like if you take, if you take, if you take plants. And you extract the, 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 the soul of that plant, yeah. or you extract the, uh, the, 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 you burn it out, so to speak, it's a drug. Like like the coca leaf, you refine the coca leaf. You burn it, when you burn it and you just get high, yeah. it has no more uses. It's a drug. Yeah. But same thing with food, when you extract the nutrition from the food, you not eat food anymore. You eating an edible drug. It's an edible. It's a drug. Skittles, all that shit. It's basically drugs. That's why. That's why more people are dying from their diet than the actual drug. You, you know how many people do you know that really died from crack cocaine? Versus how many family members you know that died from their diet? Diabetes. Diabetes. High blood pressure. That's another type of drug. That's right. Hey, if I may add, I recently found out that that's reversal. Oh, yeah. You can get the All that, man. And die and right. Diabetes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, yeah. But, but Esau says it's hereditary. But, yeah. you, but you know what's hereditary? The brother Barakia from New Orleans said it, and I believe him. He said what's hereditary is how your body reacts to that shit. Right. Because I can eat what you eat. We can eat both eat that American diet. You might stay lean. But I might get all fucked up. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm hot. It's a it's genetics. It's genetics. It's genetics. My daddy had the same diseases that my granddaddy had, but they all inherited that same American diet. Yeah. We won't walk around in Jerusalem with no damn diabetes, man. That's why certain brothers can eat sweets yeah. all the time, yeah. drink beer. Look. Stay lean. Hey. Elder War, you know, I mean, yeah. I just, you know, we put these beers out of right, right. Elder War is the meanest brother I know. He has no beer good. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, man. how you do it, brother? Man, we go 10 days doing that. Man, I, like, And now with that, my life would get messed up. Right, right. If I if I adopt the lifestyle of certain brothers that they got different spirits and different tribes, yeah, yeah, I'll yeah. be unemployed, evicted in like a week, man. Right. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. All these are not profitable for all men. Oh, man. Right. That's but that's if a brother true. try to inherit our lifestyle, they'll get depressed. They'll be depressed. Yeah. They'll be like, I can't do shit. I'm, I'm proud of myself. Do <laughs> but I don't do shit. <laughs> so, hey, but you, hey, that's, that's the, that's the body of your house shot. But you know what I mean? This is just more proof that in every facet of existence in Babylon, Esau was the devil, man. Right. 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 Esau got your baby mama or your wife, your woman. Skipping over her own breast and giving a baby a chemical yeah. formula, formula. Right. formula, man. That's right. And now you wonder why the baby got a, a fucked up attention span. Uh, right. He all over the place, man. Got <laughs> little arms and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big head, you know. Yeah. <laughs>
This is uh, Ezekiel chapter 4, verse 13. And the Lord said, Even thus shall the children of Israel eat their defiled bread among the Gentiles, where I had driven them. Because I think in that same chapter, don't, don't let me lie to you. Yep, like Ezekiel 4 and 9, he was breaking down the staple bread. He was like, take the bread and make barley and millet and make a bread out of that. Because they're going to be an example of how Israel is going to eat when they go through a famine. But on the flip side, it's actually healthy. Because now in America, they actually have a brand called Ezekiel 4 and 9. Ezekiel bread, huh? Mm. Yeah. It's, called, it's called Ezekiel, Ezekiel bread. bread. Yeah. And they got it from Ezekiel 4 and 9. <laughs> but really, really, that was the emergency food during a time of famine. That's how you know the spirit of the Lord is about to take over the earth. Right? Yep. Yep. So it's, it's, it's about to be a drastic change. Yep. When you start seeing that, you're seeing our people you know, coming to the knowledge of who they are. And you're seeing bread named after the scriptures. Yep. Yep. Come on. Ezekiel is called Ezekiel bread. Man, that's beautiful. Because, like I said, uh, although that was really supposed to be, it's supposed to have been a bad thing, but even that is healthier than all the stuff that you see on the shelves, man. Mm -hmm. Because you know, one of the things that we gotta tackle in Babylon, <coughs> some of it's not mentioned directly in the scriptures. Yep. So you gotta like, uh, pro like I, said, I keep bringing out processed food, man. It's not a sin, but you gotta go deeper than going to Burger King and telling them no bacon. Right. You gotta go deeper than that. You know? Like you say, I believe that's in Corinthians 2, you say uh, all things uh, are lawful, but not all things are expedient, meaning yeah. they're not beneficial for you just because it's not a sin to eat GMOs, you know, yeah. but certain of them are though, because some of them GMOs got pork, pork in it. You know, a lot of refried yeah. beans. Yeah, yeah, a lot of refried beans got pork in it. A lot of a lot of that stuff has gelatin. Yep. Some of that gelatin comes from that swine. Yep. You know, but then you gotta ask yourself, why the world you got? Because really, gelatin is supposed to be like the uh, the bones mm -hmm. of dead animals. They don't, Esau doesn't waste anything. Right. So the, the bones of the animals that he kills, he takes that and like he uses some chemical and it makes it like a jelly like, jelly -like substance. Mm -hmm. Like back in elementary, you might ever put a chicken bone in a cup of vinegar. Yep. And it get jelly like. It get jelly like. <laughs> I think this is how they make gelatin. Okay. With the bone, the cattle, the cattle bones. Mm. Yeah. But it's like the marrow or something. Yeah. 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 It's marrow. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I think they do something similar to that to make, get that get that gummy substance. Yeah. Yeah. But you have to ask yourself, why would you do that? Yeah. To to put that, you know. If I may add, um, what is the standard American diet? What word is the standard American diet known for? Sad. Sad. Uh, sad. Hey, hey, hey. Standard American diet. Oh, it's sad. It's sad. Yeah. Hey. Oh. And it's heavy because when you detox, mm -hmm. you're in it, you're, 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 you, you get happy. Yeah. When you I detox from that American shit, yeah. you, you, you be in a, a good mood. More energy. Hey, probably that dark spirit that, that, that be in the hood. Hey, hey, look what they look what they eat, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Hot That's what Esau puts hey. in the hood. Hey, I remember uh, you saying that too, brother. Just trying uh, uh, to cut back on, you know, snicker bar shit. Like, you know, Jay grew up on that bullshit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> hey, lots of like, uh, yeah. you know, <laughs> hey, honey buns, <laughs> everything. <laughs> Corner spot <laughs> shit. He was going to say, sorry, he was going to. You know, eat more fruit because <laughs> hey, your body feel more uh, refreshed after that, man. I, will, man. I I know for myself, man, it, 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 it replenishes you. You know what I'm saying? You can eat, you can eat fruits and vegetables, man. It, it, it'll, it'll give you, it'll burst you up, man. Yeah. It'll, it'll replenish you. Hey, you know? Yup, yup. And then, cause uh, the meat that we eat is processed, and that clogs up your arteries. Yeah. So it clogs up your arteries with uh, what they call mucus or plaque. So hey, you ever um. You were like uh, when you washing dishes and your mom about to have like that bowl of oil, that Crisco. Yeah. But what happened to that Crisco? It dried up. Yeah. It got it dried up, man. And then you got the oil going out of sink and it dries Clogged up. Now your the faucet gets stopped up. Clogged up. Clogged up. Clogged up. Yeah. Same thing in your body. We eat that food that has the uh, that end up clogging up your arteries. That fat, that fat start clogging up your arteries. What happened? Now you got poor blood circulation. Now your heart got a pump harder to get that blood out, man. Uh -huh. And if you and, and your blood, if it, it, it's carrying oxygen and nutrients all throughout your body. Yeah, yeah. So if you got poor blood circulation, yeah. that means you got poor oxygen supply in your body. Yeah. So now your body is really in the emergency. I mean, I'm not, I didn't, I'm not like a physician, physician, but we know this. <laughs> and that's why you try to, 
to try to get it in? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah. Cause you gotta pour, you gotta pour, you gotta blood supply yeah. going yeah. down there. Do the important diet, cause you got fat clogging up your arteries or mucus or plaque yeah. clogging up your arteries. But guess what?